Hey everyone, Gigi here. And in this series, we'll be exploring how to secure and use your Bitcoin with Bull Wallet and various hardware wallets. In this video, we'll be focusing on Cold Card Q. If you're looking for top tier security and ease of use, you're in the right place. We'll cover everything from connecting your device to receiving and sending Bitcoin. And finally, explore some of the unique features that make Cold Card Q stand out. Let's get started. Connecting your Cold Card Q to your Bull Wallet. The first step is to power up your Cold Card Q device. Once you're logged in, you can enter your passphrase if applicable. If not, you proceed to the next step, which is selecting advanced slash tools. We will then check that the firmware is up to date on your cold card device. So you select update firmware, select show version, and make sure you're running version 1.3.4Q, which was released on 30th of September. If your cold card is running an older firmware version, make sure to visit cold card website to update your firmware before proceeding with the next step. We then select export wallet, we go down and choose bull Bitcoin. And we will be presented with an export QR code. Now on our mobile device, we go in the right top corner to the settings button. We select Bitcoin settings, import wallet and cold card Q. Open the camera, scan the QR. As you can see, the descriptor has been entered. And the last step is to enter a label. We will put cold card Q. Select import and your setup is now complete. Now that your cold card Q is connected, let's look at how easy it is to receive Bitcoin. The beauty of using a hardware wallet like cold card Q with a bull wallet is that you don't even need your hardware device physically connected to generate a receive address. All you have to do is simply select your cold card Q wallet, which we just imported, and select the receive button. Bull Wallet will instantly display your unique Bitcoin address and the corresponding QR code. You can now share this address or QR code with anyone who wants to send you Bitcoin. You will securely receive your funds directly into your cold card Q wallet to broadcast transactions from your cold card Q using your Bull Wallet. So, what you do is first you select the cold car wallet, which we have imported, click send, open the camera. You scan the QR code of the Bitcoin wallet you want to send to or copy paste the address, enter the amount. In this example, we'll send 50,000 sets. Click continue. You can see it's sending from the cold car Q wallet to the wallet that we scanned, the amount, network fees. By default, they're always set to the fastest but you can choose economic slow if your transaction is not high priority or even set a custom fee for sub one sat per V byte fee transaction. So we'll keep it as default fastest. And also in advanced settings, you can choose select coins manually. You can individually select which UTXOs you wanna use on this input. For now, we'll use everything by default. So the next step is show PSBT. Now. Going to our cold car queue, we are logged in. We will select QR button in the left top corner. We will scan the QR code. This will now show us the transaction. We're sending 50,000 sats, the network fee. If we scroll one down, we'll see the address we're sending it to. So you can verify that it's the exact same address you want to send to. And we click enter which will sign the transaction. Once the transaction is signed, we go back to the device, we click I'm done, click camera, we scan the QR code on cold card Q, and we scroll down and broadcast the transaction. And that's it. You have successfully broadcasted your transaction from cold card Q using Bull Wallet. Beyond its core function, the Cold Car Q boasts several unique features that elevates its security and user experience unparalleled to any other hardware wallet. 
Some of these unique features include a full QWERTY keyboard. Unlike many hardware wallets, the cold card Q features a full QWERTY keyboard, making passphrase entry, seed phrase input, and general navigation incredibly easy and secure, reducing the risk of software keyloggers. A large LCD screen, which is vital for verifying transaction details and press phrases clearly. Another point is industrial QR code scanner. So as you can see, the cold car Q includes a dedicated QR scanner with LED illuminations. This allows for secure and efficient scanning of addresses or PSBTs directly from your computer screen, minimizing manual input errors. It also features dual micro SD card slots. This is perfect for storing encrypted backups, multi-sig configurations, or even for air-gapped operations. The device is powered by AAA batteries or USB-C, offering a flexibility and portability, especially for air-gapped use cases. Cold Car Q also has a really powerful feature called Key Teleport, which you can find in Advanced Tools, and you scroll down and you will find Key Teleport. This allows for secure and easy transfer of sensitive data like seed phrases, seed vault content, secure notes and passwords, and even full device backups between two different cold card devices. The wallet also includes dual secure elements, which can be found right here at the back top corner, protecting your private keys and offering a robust defense against physical and software attacks. And the final unique feature I wanna highlight is the trick pin settings, which Cold Card Q has a plethora of. So if you go to settings, login settings, and go to trick pins, you need to set up the new trick pin password, which in this case, we'll just use 111 for demo purposes. And you can see we have different options. We can brick self. So if you enter this pin, the device will be bricked and unusable forever. You have wipe seed. If you enter this password, the seed will be wiped from your secure element. You have Juris wallet, meaning that if this seed is entered, a totally separate wallet will be entered as compared to your main wallet. Look blank, which means if you enter it, essentially the court card will look freshly wiped. You can also set a just reboot, meaning if you enter this pin, the device will just be rebooting. This is just a few of them. There's a lot more, but yeah. To conclude, Cold Card Q has a plethora of advanced trick pin features, security features, and advanced use features. If you're a Bitcoin power user, Cold Card device is the one for you. And there you have it, a complete guide to setting up and using your Cold Card Q with a bull wallet, along at looking at its impressive features. The combination of Cold Card Q's robust security and Bull Wallet's user friendly interface provides an excellent solution for managing your Bitcoin security. And if you found this tutorial helpful, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. And make sure to check out our other videos in this series covering different hardware wallets compatible with Bull Wallet. Thank you for watching and stay secure.